Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to Audio Tips. In today's tutorial, we're going to go into modulation. We're going to go down to uh, uh, modulation delay. I'm going to open it up. Today, basically, I just want to I want to go into the audio effects folder, open up this plugin, uh, show you guys a little bit about it, show you guys what kind of options the plugin has to offer. Um, uh, basically, show you guys around it and give you guys a little description and overview on it. So basically, what this plugin does is it just gives you modulation delay. So it's going to add effect onto your uh, vocal track and it's going to delay it for you. Um, uh, you got your feedback button here. This is how much feedback you want to hear out of the out of the delay. You got your flanger effect and your course effect. This is how much of this effect you want, how much percentage of it you want in. Uh, your modulation intensity, intensity. This is how intense you want your uh, effect to sound. Uh, LFO uh, 1 and LFO 2. Um, Basically, well, you guys can move this around to what sounds best to you guys. I don't really use this much. I keep it at uh, I keep it at fifty <coughs> percent. Sorry, let's keep that at fifty percent. Uh, don't play around with these too much. Uh, uh, as soon as you guys are all done, you guys have the effect that you guys want. You guys can uh, uh, hire the modulation uh, volume by this knob right here and then this is the output and that goes into your mix uh, that's basically it I just want to show you guys what kind of plugin it was later on in the future I'm gonna show you guys how I use this plugin and how I uh, how I get the best optimum results out of it but for right now uh, go in check it out uh, tr uh, try it out hopefully it'll be a positive uh, uh, positive lesson for you guys and thank you guys for watching and please subscribe